Hi, today I'm going to show you how to calculate bond price and accrued interest on the Texas Instruments BA2 Plus calculator. I'll also show you how the Texas Instruments BA2 Plus Professional will display modified duration. We'll use an example to help us. If somebody invests into a bond that matures in four years and three months time with an annual coupon rate of 7%, paid every six months, and a yield to maturity of 8%, based on a 3360 day count method, what is the bond's price, what is the accrued interest, and what is the modified duration? So to do this, we need to enter the bond spreadsheet on the calculator. So we press second and the number nine, which is the bond button. And then the calculator requires a settlement date and a redemption date. If you have these, that's fine, you can enter them. But for the purpose of this question, we can simulate four years and three months by entering a start date of the 1st of January 2000 and a redemption date of the 1st of April 2004. I have my calculator set to the USA default settings, which means that you need to put them in in the order of month, month, dot, day, day, year, year. So to enter the 1st of January 2000, so you input 1.0100 and press enter. And then the down arrow to enter the coupon rate of 7% and enter. And then the down arrow to enter the redemption date, which is 4.0104. Enter. And then the down arrow to move to the redemption value, which you leave as 100. Down arrow again, then to change to the 360 day count method, you press second and set. And then down arrow again, you leave the coupons per year as two. Down arrow again, enter the yield of 8%. And down arrow again, and then you just press compute for the price, which gives you 96.63, which is the price that we're looking for. Then press the down arrow again to get the accrued interest. Now to see the modified duration, we'll switch over to the Texas Instruments uh, professional version of the calculator, which I've entered the information in earlier. As you can see, we have the accrued interest here as the same figure. And then if you press the down arrow, you get the duration figure. Everything else is the same. Um, in both calculators as far as this calculation is concerned. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Have a wonderful day.